Hello everyone, and welcome to my British Royal Family official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. An ex vogue proofreader has considered the Princess of Grains in his stake for her way to deal with gems. The comment about Princess Kate's way to deal with gems was made on the digital broadcast Inventive Discussions, which is facilitated by Susie Menkes, 79, the previous Vogue manager. The notable pundit, who in 2014 got an OBE from the late Sovereign for her work in design news coverage, welcomed Ditty Walton, the ongoing gems supervisor of English Vogue, on the show so they could discuss the Princess of Rib's latest looks. The previous proofreader of Vogue Worldwide guaranteed that Kate, 41, doesn't appear to be as amped up for gems as her stepmother by marriage Camilla, 76, in spite of having the chance of wearing an assortment of uncommon and costly precious stones. Miss Menx asserted, the Princess of Ribs is somewhat of a failure about gems. She gives the feeling that she possibly puts it on as the need should arise. I envision her looking delightful in one of those outfits in the background and afterward pulling a face as though to say, do I need to wear this? Lady Sarah Chateau was trickling in Princess Margaret's jewels at the crowning ritual. She gives no feeling of revering adornments and being satisfied to put it on. The style master likewise underscored how Sovereign Camilla, then again, is by all accounts substantially more intrigued by adornments. And Menkes added, she doesn't appear to have Camilla's bliss at wearing adornments. The Princess of Grains wears a blend of gems from the regal assortment and different things she has bought from a high road since she wedded into the imperial family. Try not to miss. Kate drops key extra, however it actually looks perfect on Beatrice and Eugenie. Sovereign Camilla wears 630 pounds raincoat and silver umbrella in extraordinary Yarmouth today. Meghan and Harry could move 100 miles from Montecito, a glance at the area. In November 2022, Kate went to her most memorable state feast at Buckingham Royal Residence as the new Princess of Ribs and wore a bunch of Princess Diana's jewel and pearl drop studs. Furthermore, she wore an astounding 10,600 pounds pearl tuft hoops with her green Jenny Packham, dress on her imperial visit to Jamaica in 2022. The princess obviously prefers more costly adornments, picking to wear 3,500 pounds white gold studs at the Singer White City Theatre in November 2019. Van Cleef and Arpels, a pricey brand cherished by every one of the royals, has likewise been investigated by Kate, who wore a one-of-a-kind Alhambra neckband at BFTA in 2020 and the later Croning Celebration show in May. However, at that point, the mother of three likewise prefers to wear high-road brands. For example, Kate went to the yearly BAFT days in London in spring, while at the same time wearing a bunch of 17 pounds and 99 pence rose gold hanging Zara hoops with shocking brightening leaves. Public trust free passes in Friday's paper, Princess Kate is marked a failure about gems contrasted with Sovereign Camilla. An ex vogue proofreader has considered the Princess of Grains a mistake for her way to deal with gems. By Dorothy Y. Roy D. Dine, 736, Mary, Joel 26, 2023 Refreshed. 816, Mary, Joel 26, 2023, 13, Bowo K. Arc. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge visit Belize, Jamaica and the Bahamas, Day 5. Kate wearing precious stone and emerald hoops in Jamaica, picture, Getty. The comment about Princess Kate's way to deal with gems was made on the digital broadcast Inventive Discussions, which is facilitated by Susie Menkes, 79, the previous Vogue supervisor. The notable pundit, who in 2014 got an OBE from the late Sovereign for her work in design news coverage, welcomed Ditty Walton, the ongoing GEMS supervisor of English Vogue, on the show so they could discuss the Princess of Rib's latest looks. The previous proofreader of Vogue Worldwide guaranteed that Kate, 41, doesn't appear to be as amped up for GEMS as her stepmother by marriage Camilla, 76, 
in spite of having the chance of wearing an assortment of uncommon and costly precious stones. As Menx asserted, the princess of ribs is somewhat of a failure about gems. She gives the feeling that she possibly puts it on as the need should arise. I envision her looking delightful in one of those outfits in the background and afterward pulling a face as though to say, do I need to wear this? Understand, Emoi. Woman Sarah Chatto was trickling in Princess Margaret's jewels at the crowning ceremony. V and a 2023 summer party. Appearances. Susie Menkes said Kate is a mistake in her way to deal with gems. Picture, Getty. The leader of the Republic of South Africa visits the unified realm, day one. Kate wore Diana studs at the state dinner in November 2022. Picture, Getty. She gives no feeling of loving gems and being satisfied to put it on. The style master likewise underscored how sovereign Camilla, then again, is by all accounts substantially more intrigued by adornments. As Menkes added, she doesn't appear to have Camilla's bliss at wearing adornments. The Princess of Grains wears a blend of gems from the regal assortment and different things she has bought from a high road since she wedded into the imperial family. Try not to miss. Kate drops key frill, however it actually looks perfect on Beatrice and Eugenie, L-A-T-E-S-T. -E Sovereign Camilla wears 630 pounds raincoat and silver umbrella in extraordinary Yarmouth today, textile. Meghan and Harry could move 100 miles from Montecito. A glance at the area, P-R-O-P-A-R-T-Y. Enter your email address here. Buy in. We go through your sign to give content in manners you've assented to and to work on how we might interpret you. This might incorporate adverts from us and outsiders in light of our comprehension. You can withdraw whenever. More data. England Amusement Film Grants BFT Royals. Kate Zara stars at BF Dare, picture, Getty. In November 2022, Kate went to her most memorable state dinner at Buckingham Castle as the new Princess of Ribs and wore a bunch of Princess Diana's precious stone and pearl drop hoops. Furthermore, she wore an astounding 10,600 pounds pearl tuft hoops with her green Jenny Packham dress on her imperial visit to Jamaica in 2022. The princess obviously prefers more costly adornments, picking to wear 3,500 pounds white gold studs at the Singer White City Theater in November 2019. Van Cleef and Arpels, a pricey brand cherished by every one of the royals, has likewise been investigated by Kate, who wore a one-of-a-kind Alhambra neckband at BFTA in 2020 and the later Croning Celebration show in May. Moving, Kate wore Carole's 14,300 pounds hoops at a film debut, shows shared taste. Kate wore Carole's 14,300 pounds studs at a film debut, shows shared taste. Woman Kitty's wedding was fairly exorbitant, yet her outfit was a masterpiece. Woman Kitty's wedding was fairly exorbitant, yet her outfit was a masterpiece. European illustrious channels one of Princess Kate's most notable coat dress minutes. European regal channels one of Princess Kate's most notorious coat dress minutes. Ruler Charles I.I. observes first Christmas as ruler with regal family. Kate's 100 pounds hoops on Christmas Day. Picture, Getty. However, at that point, the mother of three likewise prefers to wear high road brands. For example, Kate went to the yearly BAFTAs in London in spring, while at the same time wearing a bunch of 17 pounds and 99 pence rose gold hanging Zara hoops with shocking brightening leaves. In December of last year, it was accounted for that the Sovereign of Grains had provided Kate with a bunch of 100 pounds studs from the high road retailer Cezanne, which she wore to the Sandringham Faith Gathering. On a regal commitment to October 2021, Kate wore a couple of 11 pounds and 20 pence gold plated wind band hoops from ASOS with a monochrome red outfit. Thanks for watching if you like this video, so please don't forget to subscribe my channel and don't miss any update.